Hey guys, welcome back. Um, okay. So today I'm gonna be redying my hair. I don't know if you can tell, but it's like brown again. I just, okay, you know, like the day after you dye your hair jet black, I need it to be that jet black at all times or I'm not satisfied. Wait, do I need to dye it? I feel like I should cut off my, um, what to call my, honestly, if I were to cut up to where, to it, like, so like all the bad stuff is gone, I would literally have to cut up to here because this is all so fried. Even though I've cut my hair so many times and didn't dye it for literally like a year. Does not make sense. Okay. So, gonna dye your hair. Um, I, I completely forgot that box dye is so bad for you and I don't know why I did that. It was just a spur of the moment thing. So I got some stuff from Sally's and I got... Holy fuck, why are there so many? There's a hundred gloves in here. Extra large gloves, cause like my hands are fat as fuck. I have sausage fingers. Breakfast sausage fingers. Breakfast. 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 Anyway, extra large. Okay. Then I got This age beautiful with biotin. Um, it's permanent anti-aging hair color. It's jet black. Um, I got two of these because I wasn't sure how much I would need. Why is this open? Who the fuck opened this? But yeah, it's the same thing. Who the fuck opened my package? What if they like, what if this isn't the same color and they just slip this in there? How do you read the color? Hello? Oh, yeah, it's the right color. Anyways, so, update. Um, I had to take, <clears throat> A bit of time off therapy because I was just really emotional and going through it because like my mom's death anniversary was last week and you know a couple other things that I don't want to speak on um but I was just really emotional like I didn't really know how to feel like I was just I was just going through it and I ended up like getting back into like that cycle where I was staying in bed all the time. Um, wasn't cleaning anything. I know I you don't usually clean, but like, but it was bad. It was really bad. Like my place was actually disgusting and I had to get um, Tatiana to come here and clean. And she organized my closets in both rooms. She switched around my bed and everything. Her and her friend, actually. And this is weird to say this, saying her and her friend, because honestly, if you don't know me, or if you can probably tell, maybe, I kind of gatekeep my friends. Like, I'm, like, really jealous when they hang out with other people, and, like, I get mad when, like, they get close with other people, because I'm, like, I don't want other people experiencing them the way I do because I want them all to myself. It just, it's really weird. I know, I don't know why I'm like that, but that's something I've been talking to my therapy, my therapist about, um, basically. <sighs> why am I so scared of like, them being friends with someone else or like, why do I even care type thing? And like, it, when you, it's like, whenever I say some shit like to my, to my therapist like this, like I'll literally be like, um, I'll be like, oh yeah, like I'm, okay, like for example, like I'm really possessive over my best friend. Um, so like every time 
she gets a new friend, I act like a fucking like jealous boyfriend. Like I'll literally be like, oh, are you having fun with your bestie? Or ew, you're with her. Okay, I actually don't like her friends, but like, um, but like, you know, it's a, it's a bad habit. And I was like, yeah, like, um, I don't like her hanging out with other people. Like I'm scared. Um, they're, they're going to like become best friends and she's going to take my best friend from here or something like that. And the therapist just like says it back to me. And then when she says it out loud, what I've been thinking, it makes me sound like stupid. And she was, she's made a lot of good points and I'm just like, true. That's not really how it went, but you know, whatever. Um, okay. So I got the volume 10 and then I got this little cute thingy. Oh my God, I can see myself in it. <laughs> Hey guys. But yeah. I've also been so depressed. Not I'm not even, I don't know the word. Not depressed. Okay, yeah, depressed. But I'm not like sad. I don't know. But I've been like, the guy that I hooked up with a successful Bumble date or whatever wants to hang out again and we've made plans and I keep ditching him. And honestly, what am I doing? Because he's so fine. He down to make OnlyFans content with me. He talks to me like every day. He lives up the street. Like, what am I doing with my life? Like, I haven't posted on OnlyFans in so long to the point where people were reporting me for not posting. And then they got, I got like a notification from OnlyFans saying that they're gonna pause my account if I don't start posting. So I started posting again. But I really need like a video of me. S U C K I N G D I C K with my new hair and glasses. So I'm gonna probably try to get that in this week. Is it hot in here or is it just me? I know it's not just me, so give me a second. Pennywise, are you hot? Pennywise, are you Sorry, I'm breathing really heavy and I'm having a hard time breathing because I still have my chest infection and I didn't get it treated. I didn't fucking turn in the prescription and get the fucking bed, so it's been getting kind of worse. But anyways, the point being is that usually I would like tell like my best friends or like any of my friends like, no. Usually just my best friend. Like, I don't want to meet your f little friends. Like, whatever. But Tatiana brought over a friend and she was cool. And she helped a lot. She was really good at cleaning. Um. Yeah. That's really about it. I'm scared. Also, I got that. Well, I just ordered it right now. The, um, Cer Cerive, Cerave, 
film, whatever, filming cleanser for my acne, so hopefully that. Okay, do you see how greasy my hair is? I showered yesterday. All right, I didn't read any of this. What? I'm bad at math. What the fuck does this mean? Developer mixing ratio is one one. Ratio one one. <laughs> Says equal parts color and developer. I mean that. I mean I know it's a. Let me just you know. This says blah, blah, blah. Fortifying your formula with biotin looking for fuller, thicker looking hair. Easy one, one mixing. I know it means like, <coughs> I know it means you put equal part of this as you do the developer, but This is gonna come out in like, and the developer is liquidy. So, you know what? Please just ignore anything I'm saying right now. I promise you I'm not this stupid. I mean, I am, but like, you know, I don't wanna, I don't want you guys to know that. <laughs> I'm gonna grab my other phone one second. One, one, what the fuck does that mean? She's not gonna answer. Cause when I home, I hope you pick up the phone. I'd like to talk to you. I hope you answer. When I call. You pick up the phone. I'd like to talk to you. This is fun. Oh! Honestly, like, I don't think okay. One, one, maybe if I was good at math, I would. Be rich. Ooh. 
because I don't think that was one one. I don't know what the fuck it is. Yeah, but maybe if I was good at math, I would be rich. Cause like you know how math people are like in the like business and like stock marketing and like all that trading shit. Like that could be me, but no, here I am. I am stuck on band-aid and the band-aid stuck on me. Great. I don't think that was equal, but we will try. Why is there hair on it? It didn't even go near my hair. No, I don't want to. Ew, I don't like this. Bye. Ugh, ugh. I hate hair. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No! Get away! Get away! Okay. And then we mix it. It looks like eggs. Kind of. This is fun. This is easy. I can do this. You can do it. Put your back into it. You can do it. Put your back into it. I can do it. Put my back into it. Wait, okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh my god, I'm so smart. Look, look, look. That doesn't look like it's gonna be enough for my hair. <clears throat> I said, what's one, one? She said, huh, what does that mean? I said, a ratio thingy. We can't both be stupid, huh? I know damn well you passed my ass. Oh, they did go into my thing. Look, there's instructions with this one and no instructions with the other one. They scammed me. Um, it was ask. It was telling me how much. <coughs> How much volume developer and how much um dye to put into the bowl but i think i found it i figured it out sorry you didn't answer your call i could have been dying in a freaking tornado but you wouldn't know because you didn't answer the call selfish okay so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take i think half of this i think i don't know if i need the full one but we're just gonna do half oh my god whoa I think I saw a ghost. I think I saw a pretty tat. What the fuck? Okay, so we're gonna put half in here. Ooh, she farting. That was me. And then we're gonna put the cover back on. Okay. Let me see what she said. She said, when two quantities are measured in the same proportion. Did she just Google that? Did you just Google that? And I know you always have your D&D on, but it's okay. Because one day I'm going to win the lottery. And you're going to be the first person I call. And if you don't pick up, I'm not giving you any money. That'll teach her. Okay. And then... We're gonna put equal parts. Oh my god, on my nail almost slipped on. Ooh. Okay. And then. 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 Okay. Oh. Okay, so then we're gonna mix it all up. Oh my god, what the fuck was I gonna say? I literally have to mix. Oh. It's. I'm really hoping a lot of you don't have the same at name, but the girl with the username Aaliyah King, I think, or Aaliyah dot something, it's A L I Y A, was the winner of winning my stupid jacket from Shein. So if you could like comment on this video so I can contact you somewhere or whatever. If you actually want the jacket, I don't know if some of you were just playing to like play because I got a lot of DM. Of people saying, I don't know if she wants a jacket, I just wanted a chance to. But okay, you know. 
<laughs> Silly guy. Okay, so. Whew. I'm not tripping. It is hot in here. Or is it just some thick? I don't know, but I'm a grocery shopper and then I got a lot of salad. What the fuck does that have to do with anything? <laughs> what the fuck, bitch? We don't want care if you got a salad. Anyway, so I decided just now in my bed that since I'm dyeing my hair today, I'm gonna have the guy over tomorrow. Um. Oh, I'm gonna show you guys my organized closet after too. Cause I know someone, you guys are probably curious. I kind of messed it up a little bit already. <sighs> it's definitely on. I really hate, like, I know it's a fact, but I hate that everyone like was always saying like, oh, you're gonna die of a heart attack. You're so fat, you're gonna have a heart attack any minute because it's become one of my little fears now. And I've been talking to my therapist about it and she's like, oh, like, have you had a heart had a heart heart attack? <laughs> Have you have a heart attack? Have you had a heart attack before? And I said, no, miss, I have not. She's like, then don't worry about it. And I was like, okay, ma'am. But yeah, I think that's what I was the, what I was trying to say with my salad that I bought is that I ordered a bunch of healthy food because just in case I have a heart attack. I mean, to help prevent me having a, you know what? Fuck it, I'm not even explaining this. Just know that you guys put this fear in my head that wasn't there and I'm literally always, I'm already scared of everything. Literally everything, like I'm scared of the dark. I'm scared of someone breaking in and murdering me. I can't shower in the dark because I'm scared of someone coming in and murdering me while I shower. I wake up every 15 minutes to look at my door to make sure no one came into my room. There were so many fears that I had and everyone's saying like, oh, I hope you die of a heart attack. You're gonna have a heart attack now. Thanks, bitch, cause I think I'm gonna have a heart attack too. Okay. Breath. But anyways, uh, my bathroom needs a huge cleanup. It's really weird because I was on bathroom duty when I lived with my dad when I was a teenager <laughs> and I used to clean the bathroom every time and I hated when it was dirty actually I never got dirty my parents kept the house really clean anyways my point is having a dirty bathroom is fucking disgusting and I ugh. like the ones the guy was here last time it was so dirty too and I literally told him don't go in the bathroom don't go in the bathroom I look over and he's in the motherfucking bathroom and he still chose to come back maybe he's weird I don't know. I don't know. Because I know my coochie isn't good. I know my head game. He didn't experience it. So what does he want? Maybe he's, um, all the buildings are like rainbow color. I'll show you guys that out there. Okay. Breathe in, Chelsea. <gasps> Who the fuck is Chelsea? Breathe in. Jenny. Breathe in. Joanna. <laughs> That's my name. <laughs> Silly girl. Oh, wow. What are you doing? Oh my God, it's been 24 minutes. Guys, I can't breathe. Actually, it might just be anxiety because I don't think I took my pills today. You know, that is the biggest piss off. Okay, for any of you guys who take pills daily, do you ever forget if you took your pill or not so you don't take it because you don't want to take too many? Think that's what happened today and it happens to me all the time now and I'm like, what the fuck? Did I take it? Did I not take it? Somebody please help me. 
I think my dad's gone crazy. Ah! We're gonna be a cutie pie, a cutie pie, a cutie pie. I'm gonna be a cutie pie, the cutest in the city. I'm gonna be a cutie pie, a cutie pie, a cutie pie. I'm gonna be a cutie pie, a cutie, cutie, cutie. I think I have to take off the glasses because I don't want to get oh another reason I've been like so like distant and like had no energy if you take trazodone you know how strong it is and I'm on a hundred mg or whatever and Tatiana told me this before, like, she kept telling me to get on it. And I've been on it before, like, back in high school. But being on it again is, like, I don't know. So, basically, she told me that whenever she takes it, she needs to be, like, in bed or, like, near her bed or something. Because if she takes it and then she, like, goes to get up, she's, like, all, like, dazed out. And I did that last night. And it was fucking scary. I could barely walk to my bed. But here's the thing. It hasn't even been fucking working because I literally wake up every 15 damn minutes. And I'm tossing and I'm turning. And then the whole next day I'll be tired as motherfucker. So if you guys have any suggestions for like good sleep medication, please fill me in. Because this right now is not it. Like... When I don't sleep, I get grumpy. Like, I'm a fucking horrible, like, I used, like, for those of you who don't know, I have, like, really bad insomnia to the point where, like, I can stay awake for, like, a week. And then when I do stay awake for that long, I end up in the hospital because I start hallucinating. And then I'll literally be thinking I'm dying. And I go there and they're like, oh, it's just anxiety. And I'm like, oh, that's, that's nice. And then they just send me off with no sleeping meds. They don't let me sleep there and take a nap. Like, hello, I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. No, I'm not. No, I'm, you are not dying. You cannot die before your birthday, girl. It's... My birthday is in... A month and a week, I think. Yeah, a month and a week, I think. How the fuck do people do this? How am I supposed to section my hair off? Am I doing it right? I really wish I had like a friend who like lives right beside me that could do all this for me. Have you guys ever had someone in your life who's not usually nice to you be really, 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 really over the top nice to you all of a sudden? <sighs> because it's happening to me right now and I'm scared that that person is dying and not telling me because... What? Also, I'm referring to my dad. <laughs> No, he's nice to me, but, like, he's not, he's not, like, you know. But, like, lately when he sees me, like, you can tell that, like, he's missed me and he's glad to see me. Like, he'll give me money for stuff and whatever. And, like, I'm, like, are you okay? Like, I keep asking him. I'm, like, are you dying? Like, is everything okay? And then he'll say stuff, like, oh, I just missed you. And I'm, like, I haven't, or he's, like, oh, I haven't seen you in a while. And I'm, like. No, I don't care. 
there's certain people in your, my life that I feel like if they were to die, I think I would actually just have to, you know, go with them because, no. Oh my God, this is so not, this is not how you do it. I don't care about the back because no one sees the back. I know that's such a weird thought process, but honestly, it's true. Like, I only take pictures and post them. I don't go out. Nobody's fucking me from behind. But mostly because I haven't been shaving my ass and, um... I only like getting back shots if my- Oh, for those of you who don't know as well, PCOS makes you grow extra hair on your ass, not just your chin. So, I don't think anyone wants to fuck my hairy ass. Queen of oversharing, but like still, I think like, honestly, I'm just gonna keep giving out these PCOS facts because it's just so fucked up that this is a thing. Like. I never heard of it until I got it, and, like, what? And I'm pretty sure my mom had it, too. And it actually never made sense to me how, like, because, like, growing up, she ate, like, so healthy. Like, she was always doing, like, Weight Watchers and all this stuff. She even got the bypass gastric surgery thing done. And then ended up gaining the weight, gaining weight after, and like she would walk like a lot every day because she like ran out of home, home daycare, so she would have to walk to and from the schools, you know, to pick up the kids or whatever. And now I'm trying to, I'm kind of thinking like, did she have PCOS or like, I don't even know. And I don't talk to her side of the family, so how the fuck am I supposed to ever find that out? You can't get, I don't know. Anyways, I'm gonna get off topic with that. There is no topic of this video, I'm just ranting. This isn't even ranting at this point. This is literally how I talk to myself every day. Oh, it's so cute of me. I'm just so full of cuteness. Queen of cuties. I literally almost had a heart attack today because, bitch shut up, because um, <laughs> I couldn't find my lashes and I thought that Tatiana's friend accidentally threw them out. So um, and I had, I bought like a pack of like six of the same one cause I'm like, I'm literally like ride or die for these lashes. Like I'm not even kidding when like, I refuse to buy lashes from anywhere else ever again. These make me look so fucking good. They're so fucking good. Like, she has like a signature scent that she puts on the bag that I found out. Um, and that's why it smells so good. And it's in a cute little bag always, and it's sparkly and blue, and it just, yeah. And it's so weird. Is, okay, does anyone else feel this way? You know back to those days when we all used to like buy lashes from like Walmart or like Target or uh, what's it called, Sally's? And then I look back and I'm like, ew, why the fuck was I buying lashes from Sally's and stuff like that? Because they're actually so shitty when you think about it. If you right now are watching this and you buy your lashes from Walmart or Sally's, please stop. Unless you like them, that's that's cool. But I, I think you would just prefer if you bought like better ones. That's just my legal opinion. 
Oh, you sexy, sexy, smexy, smexy. <laughs> Am I missing spots? I can't even freaking tell. Do I just like rub it in my shampoo? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, Henry. 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 Oof. Okay, I'm gonna wait. Did I throw out the instruction? How long am I supposed to put the keep this in? Anyway, I'm gonna, the point is I'm gonna turn off the camera and then when I come back, I'm gonna show you guys the closet. Or maybe I'll show you guys the closet now since I have spare time. Yeah, I think I'll do it now. <laughs> Alright, well, I've got diet <laughs> everywhere, any water, one second, so this is my room, ah, that's me, ew, I look like fucking Humpty Dumpty, that's the view, the colorful fucking lights from my room, Yes, I don't care. I'm going to sew it off every single time because I'm so happy that I live here. Like, it's so fucking beautiful. Like, I'm forever fucking grateful for where I am right now. And look, that's the YMCA pool. I wish I could, like, break in and swim in their pool. Anyways, let's continue. This is Pennywise, of course. Okay, we're going to the closet. Okay, this is my closet. And then, goes like that. Sorry, my one closet door is broken. And then we go to the other room. Why is it doesn't mean so much? Jesus. Ow. I put my clothing rack up. And by me, I mean Tati and her friend. They put the clothing racks in this closet, which is fucking genius. Thank God my friends are smart. And then this is the other side. And then this is what they did with all the extra clothes they didn't know where to put. So yeah, I think okay, that's the end of the video. This is my hair, it's not dry. And I couldn't get all the hair dye out of my face, so. I'm just going to cover it with cover-up tomorrow. Hopefully, I get the energy to suck some dick tomorrow because I really need to. And I really need to have a fucking fun time because I deserve it. Also, um, the one main thing that kind of put me into a depression, um, I can't tell you guys now what it what actually happened, but I will probably do a story time on it in like a year. I don't know, sometimes when things aren't, like, fresh, I just really want to tell this story because it's so fucked up, and, yeah. Why do glasses make my nose look big? Okay, are you supposed to wear glasses like this, or 
Is this wrong? Am I doing it wrong? Or is it supposed to be like this? But either way, they make my nose look huge. Not that my no nose is not huge. Sorry, I'm obsessed with the view. I'm wearing my little onesie. Thing from uh, Fashion Nova. Okay. Yep, that was me dyeing my hair. I'm gonna probably do a get ready with me tomorrow. And then <clears throat> the, a get ready with me slash hinge date tomorrow. Or bumble date because I'm wearing my name off. But yeah. So stay tuned for that. It might not be uploaded tomorrow. It might upload it another day. I think, but yeah, love you guys, bye.